Dictate is a tool in Microsoft Word that allows you to speak and the words are converted into text on the page. It's a quick and easy way to get your thoughts down, to write an essay or to capture notes. The dictate button on my toolbar is here. If you don't see it on your toolbar, then you may need to add it in by going to File, Options down at the bottom, Customise Ribbon, and then clicking down here to find all commands. And in this long list here, if I go down to uh, D, I will come across Dictate. When I click on that there, I would then click on Add to put it onto my ribbon. When I click on the microphone in the toolbar, a box appears on the page. And from there, I can switch the microphone on and off. The Windows shortcut key to toggle on the microphone is Alt plus back quote. Now that it's switched on, you can see my words are being converted into text full stop. I'm using the built-in microphone on my Windows laptop and I'm relying on an internet connection for it to work full stop. One of the new features of Dictate is the ability to switch on auto punctuation. I click on the settings cog down here. I can then just toggle on enable auto punctuation. I'm going to the shops to buy apples, bananas and oranges. And you can see that punctuation has been put in correctly there. Unfortunately, if you hesitate in speaking this sentence, the punctuation may be inserted incorrectly, and for some learners, this could be frustrating. Let me give you a quick example of that. I'm going to the shops to buy apples, bananas and oranges. So you may have to consider whether auto punctuation is a good feature for your learners. These are the steps we would recommend to get the best results from using the dictation feature. Compose the sentence in your head, just to be sure what you're going to say. Practice it in your head or out loud. Switch on the microphone and speak. Switch off the microphone and proofread the words that have appeared on the page. And then repeat as above. Dictation tools are available in Word Online and other Office 365 applications, such as OneNote. It's a great assistive feature and can make a big difference for your learners with writing difficulties.